This is one of my latest pieces of work, one of my latest projects. It's the slow dissection or disintegration of two jab pads. This is the left jab pad. If you're wondering what a jab pad is, it's used in boxing training. The trainer holds out the pad and the boxer hits the pad. Here you see the pad in its complete form and it's slowly disintegrating into its constituent parts down here on the bottom right. I like the idea of using drawing almost as if it were a diary, a quick sketch, a quick recording of events. In this case, I've tried to show the passage of time, the way in which one object reduces down into what is several objects, into its component parts. And here's the right jab pad. And again, you can see the jab pad in its complete form on the top left, disintegrating down onto the bottom right, and you've got all the intervals in between. I, I tend to show this type of line drawing in exhibitions with some text alongside that gives a little bit of information about what's going on. And also the writing, because of the style of font that I use, I created it from a stencil, uh, becomes a part of the work as well. I like to use this simple black on black line drawing which I create using a piece of oil pastel uh, which draws a nice thick dark line immediately you don't need to go over it too many times because it just gives the framework it gives enough of the the form the shape of the object rather than trying to completely replicate all of the the visual information about the object it gives an idea of what the object is and, and hopefully in that simple way I can try and communicate some of the personality of the object. In the past I've, I've liked the idea of trying to bring an object to life, trying to animate it, not in the literal sense as you would see with an animation or a cartoon, but in the sense that I try and bring some of the personality out of the object. With the left and right hand jab pad I've broken them apart and I've shown more aspects of the construction of the object, what makes it what it is really. It's a functional object. In the case of the jab pad, it's used for boxing training, but it also has some kind of integrity in itself. It's got, it's got a personality, it's got an identity, that's mainly through function, and it's also as a result of the parts that go into making it what it is. So it's a little bit more of an explanation of the object than you would otherwise get from just drawing the object in its complete and untouched form.